Gambia warns old British women to stop coming for sex in the country. The Gambia has issued a warning to old women from the United Kingdom who flock the country to find toy boys to look elsewhere. Please subscribe, hit the bell and click all. Then like our videos and share. The West African country has been known in recent years for its sex up reputation, where older British women will typically go on holiday in search of younger men. But Gambian officials are putting a stop to this industry, having announced they want to end the habit of people heading to the country with the sole aim of just sex. Speaking on the minutes, the director of the Gambia Tourism Board, Abu Bakar Kamara said, and I quote, what we want is quality tourists. Tourists that come to enjoy the country and the culture, but not tourists that come just for sex. Kamara explained that the former British colony aims to now move away from older female tourists in a bid to shift its reputation, which has previously been dubbed as a real-life tender dream for juridic by some. Gambia gained independence in 1965, with sex tourism making an increase in the 1990s after Thomas Cook launched budget tours and chief fly to the destination. Young sex workers, otherwise known by locals as beach boys, have long been ported escorting older women out of clubs to spend the night together. Most Gambian men who do work with older women in this way have been reportedly enticed into the industry by lack of jobs and low wages in the country, where they can instead earn 200 pounds for just one day of work, which equals a month's salary. They are said to search the white sand beaches for older women who hail from the Netherlands, Sweden, and Germany as well as the United Kingdom. A few of the encounters are arranged online before the women arrive, with the sex workers collecting them from the airport. Please subscribe, hit the bell and click all, then like our videos and share.